Ah, uh, hello there. So, hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Carl here, Deck, and I'm back today. It's cold here. Yeah. This thing's been running all night, I guarantee you. So, I'm gonna try. It's just a run. I'm going to scrub on there and hope that first because it's cold in here. And we are back. And uh, I'm lucky I woke up when I did because my phone had a rather completely out of power. My main phone. <sighs> so. Uh, notifications. Allow all Discord notification. So we are back. I left you guys off last night. I think when I was still watching videos. Uh, oh, I was still watching videos. I jumped into Factorio and started uh, prepping for the uh, site. Uh, the uh, oh my god, the uh, chemical science packs. So they have started to craft away. I see I could probably crafting speed 0 0.75. You see. Ah, uh, well I feel like you're not working as fast as supposedly you should. But I get the keys. To my new apartment in about 3 hours and 15 minutes that is 3 hours, 2 hours and 15 minutes. So around 11 I got to get on a bus to go to town then take the bus to Tampa. Uh, I'm gonna figure out. So how are you doing? 46. Okay. And you have actually not been collected that long so you should be charged within like 15 minutes or whatever. So, so I am back and I got my phone up and running or whatever, uh, a little earlier than I thought I need to go into my TikTok and change the emails and whatever else because apparently my TikTok is on my private email when it's supposed to be on my like other email or whatever the fuck and link to my like other Google account or whatever the fuck. So, so I gotta fix all of that. Anywho, we are back. I was not supposed to go post a new video. ATB. Det är assistant från Stabels Så, so, yeah, so we pretty much got the idea set. Now, I am the shirt. Oh. How we're gonna do this because if what that guy I was talked with the other day was anything to go by, I am getting a whole ass keychain full of keys for that new place. Uh, we got RFID for the entrance, we got the mailbox, we got that in the cellar, two booths, two locks, we got the outside the compostal area, or whatever the fuck. That I believe was its own keys. I'm gonna have like 5,000 different keys. What I'm hoping to do is that unless I get multiple, I'm hoping I can take and just use my RFID scanner and just copy up. So good shit, so we'll see how all, how all of that goes. I'll figure that out once I get my keys. So basically, what I will do is that. Basically, these three keys, or these two, and this boy ends up on their own kind of keychain. Uh, the only problem is I don't really have any other keychain to put those all there. So I mean, I still have shit I need to pick up in the cellar and stuff. So it's not like okay, guys, we are back. I have been inside and I have, well, my key keys have grown a bit, you can say. 
So I now got all the keys and stuff I need for the new place. So what I'm gonna do now is head head to the bus. We're gonna head over to this apartment. I forgot the GoPro at home, so we're on the phone. But we're gonna head over to the apartment. We're gonna check a few things. We're gonna try and get the uh, get the fuse box to budge. I can note down the meat there. Since that's one thing I'm planning to do every month, note down the meat there. So that I can actually keep a track of how much power I've used to a semi degree. Because, yeah, that's gonna be a thing. Then, we're, I'm also gonna look at what kind of main rail, as far as the size of incoming power and stuff, and see how easy it's gonna be for us to upgrade to RCBOs and even funny enough I figured out a thing since this is a conventional apartment I can actually buy up this apartment eventually so that's funny so if anything I may be able to buy up the apartment and do whatever to the apartment and then sell the apartment off again and earn a few bucks on that and then lease up another place or whatever so you know good shit so now I'm gonna wait for the bus, then I'm gonna head over to the new place, and then I'll meet you guys there. Oh well. So. Let's see here. There you are. And then you should be my weight box and shit. Here goes it. There we have upstairs. Three or three. I just put from us some stuff first. Here we are, the apartment, so you can see there is the oven, but you can see there's no, or well, there is an attachment point for a dishwasher there, there is that, but, uh, well, if anything, then we'll have to put the dishwasher here, run a line all over there or whatever, but no. Let's the try it. Jesus. Sex to two fanti. Are there sex to two fanti? Then we turn a whole thing. Okay. Fjorten, elve, hon fyra. Tolv vaskmaskin. Skap om bad. Ah. Alltså det må i hvert fall være en ty vampstue, kjøkken, bad, enter, sover om den boka deres. Kurs 12, 30 år. Ah. Så er så... Det der er bebytta. Ja, vi har som før, ikke du? Vet du? Ja, statsdørsbar. Det er som vør til du. Det er. Så 
yeah, we have to work to book and the view besides the point. Here is the apartment. Which means we do, we are going to have to upgrade this cable. But then that cable was there and I'm guessing what's happening there is that it goes through the wall. And up and whatever, we gotta figure out how all of that is ran. Now, here is a coax, so it seems like the network here is a coax network, which is pain, but we'll make it work. So I gotta contact Telenor about uh, that, getting a converter. So, good shit, but other than that, we are looking pretty good. We're gonna be popping that and swapping around some settings on that. But other than that, we need bigger PR cables. We need a 14... We need a 2.5 mil PR or whatever to run along here to there. Run out and through and whatever else. To get... Uh, to upgrade all of this to 16 amp and then... Uh, I don't know yet. First of all, everything is going to get paid then. But my idea is either going to be couch here somewhere, TV surround, and then desk here, or we put the TV here. But putting the TV here would be kind of me due to all of this. So really, I think the best option here is going to be smack the couch here, smack the TV there, smack my setup here. And then just upgrade to a few more outlets over here. But then in the same matter of time, this hallway is wide enough for that server rack if we move that. But what that means is that we gotta make and buy some coax and make a coax cable. And send that coax cable out into the wall. Now, this is drywall, so it should be fairly easy to drill through. And since it is drywall, to some degree, we can maybe use some insertable contacts or whatever or in wall stuff instead. So, so good shit. So. Here is one of my cupboards. So. Okay. It seems like they shot the ground, but it looks like one ground is connected. Excuse me, what, why is there a tea face waiting? My priority in the 15th, I'm going to be RCEOs, 
PR and electrical. Get all the electrical sorted out. Then the 20th, it will be paint and stuff. But the noise means that there is painted all the wallpaper on that side, which is hella fucking annoying. Or maybe purple, I suppose. Okay, guys, we are back and where are we? Well, I have taken pictures with the word phone and gone through almost every single outlet and switch and whatever else in this entire apartment. So basically, for a bedroom, your wire field comes in here and then that goes to the roof and then that goes split off to all these outlets comes in there. Then we have, have out from there goes the power to this one outlet and then on over to this outlet. Oh wow. From that outlet it goes out from there to that outlet and out from there to that outlet and over there. And then down to behind this wall comes a feed into there that comes from somewhere. Which we'll have to figure out if it comes from up there and branches there or if that happens somewhere out in here we have to check that but at least it comes in here, goes across to there, goes across to there and then there obviously comes a feed in here which then goes up to there and up to there which I haven't checked those two yet. I uh, checked the light switch here, the light switch in there, the light switch there, I checked, I checked there, I checked the outlet in there, the outlet behind here, that, that and Vago Havens up in there. So that's all checked. So what I'm gonna check now is this box. Then I'm gonna check that outlet. And uh, well, that is whatever. I may install another outlet here and tie it up off of that lamp. Or whatever. And then check that, move that to somewhere in the bedroom temporarily. Probably just in front of here or whatever. Most of the boxes and stuff is going to end up in the cellar Besides from like the main boxes of stuff uh, Simply because I need to do electrical work and paint here before we really rig anything up So really I think the only thing that's really going to bake it into here is really I don't know my desk which gets set up forever my bed, obviously. Uh, the couch, maybe. Uh, fridge. Oven. Then washing machine, dishwasher, which I have to figure out how I'm going to do the plumbing for that. Not that hard, I'll just use a tea. Or a tea, kind of, with like a double valve, which has two outputs with two valves separately from each other. To tie the water in, and then as far as the wastewater, I'll just buy one of those tea clamps. Or tea fittings, and then just put them, put them, clamp, and then put the last tube on the bottom, which goes down into the wastewater. Grab, and that will mean that the water will feed from one another into each other. But we just hope that doesn't really become a problem. And as long as we don't use them both at the same time, really, backfeeding shouldn't matter. And the machines themselves should have valves inside of them to prevent backfeeding. So that is all good. So the living room will be painted in the same grey colour which we already have. Roof will just stay white. The kitchen, I do want to still have in a red colour, but I may do, I'm going to do it in another type of colour. I want a red, but bright red colour, but I don't want the same coral red we have. So that's fine. Uh, then I forgot, but we do actually have a door here, so the plan is to move that to wherever, maybe not even have it here and just put all our jackets uh, inside of this one if we can make it work. Just put them all here and then whatever and then obviously we have you now our other clothes or whatever. And then I can maybe put something on top to handle the rest. Uh, and then the server app will go out in here. And then uh, I'll maybe, if I'm able to, install another circuit out in there that we just bind off of the new master we are going to install. And then 
and then uh, just run a direct to that C outlet and then run that directly from there since I don't have any ideas about hanging up the uh, the older electrical cab uh, I don't uh, since we do have remote heat here unless I somehow figure out you know a smart idea on how to do this whole valve system because now which one of you two is actually getting the feed? Unless it's just teed in there. Yeah, I think it's just teed in there. But if I can get like a actuator or whatever to put on here, that maybe. Uh, but for now, we're not gonna bother. Uh, whatever. Uh, we also gotta figure out which one this goes to. We also got to do so good shit. Uh, so yeah, so I pretty much got my work cut out for you. You guys are having no more power. So probably the next time you guys will see me is back from the GoPro when we're back home. Because I told Oscar to just come here and then we just drive from here since I still got to pop a few outlets and whatever else. So he's probably going to be done with work before I even manage to make my last home. So, you know. Maybe we will see what I do. And then obviously there will be roller curtains which will be installed actually recessed in here. Recessed in here which goes down. And then uh, on top of there we'll put you know curtains which are actually cut to length or whatever. So it looks a little pretty and then you know if we ever wanted to we could, uh, you know, do whatever. Now, the thing that annoys me is that it's not painted behind here, but we can't really paint behind here unless we are able to shut the water off, which I don't think, I don't even know where the water shutoff valve or if there even is individual shutoff valves for the independent apartments. Had that we gotta wait until they cool properly down throughout the whole line system, before we can turn it off. So, you know, it's all good shit. So, I'm gonna keep cracking and uh, I will see you guys whenever. Okay, so I am back here real quickly, you guys, uh, to show you guys where we have gotten. So, I have continued without backup. So, I have went Royal Ham. So we got living room right, we got living room center, living room left, living room rear left, rear left, center, center, right, right, we have bedroom left, left, center, center, right, right, a bed wall right from main entrance, we got kitchen under sink, kitchen under sink, we got kitchen oven, kitchen fridge, uh, we got junction box above kitchen shelves, junction box of Vago Havens over the kitchen shelf, locker above cooker hood, uh, locker above cooker hood, kitchen lamp right, kitchen lamp right, kitchen lamp right. So yeah, I've been taking pictures and going ham here. I'm gonna go through all of these pictures. You guys are running out of storage. Oscar, I told him to come here, so he should probably be here eventually, and then we'll get crack a lot, so I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, guys, we are back, and what you just saw was some footage from my phone that I am about to offload right as we speak, before I put this one on charge. Uh, do, 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 do. And I removed my cover because it has a tendency to become. So yeah, so we are back. I am back home. Uh, Oscar turned out to be a little late, so he wasn't going to show up for like another hour. So I started heading back home. I'm now back home. Uh, so now I will offload this. Uh, and then really what I need to start on is just the living room. Start packing on the TV and the rest of that stuff. Oh, and whatever else, while my phone is charged. Oh. 
Och då ska jag probably show up eventually and I'm first gonna get him to move my car. Let's see how well this went. So yeah, so really I'm gonna sit here and chill for a bit and then I'll get started in the living room. So yeah, stay tuned. So, we are back. And uh, where are we, may I ask? Well, far from where I had hoped we would be today. So, fridge, washing machine, oven, and dishwasher, a few plastic bags, two bags, and my bed has made it over in my new apartment. Was I hoping to have everything done today? Yes. Why did not that happen? Well, I guess we could say it's two factors. I guess the first factor, and well, I guess also the most understandable one. Asgard, when we lifted in the fridge, managed to bang his hand right on a blood vein. So that made one of his hands kind of unusable. So that's the main reason why really nothing more got done. The second reason, but not so obvious reason, and more kind of pain in the ass reason is because a friend of well, him, but also technically me and then. I don't really know if it's friends anymore or if it's starting to become something more, but anywho, we leave that out of speculations. Anywho, she was keen on getting done with moving shit now. Uh, so basically, what that resorted in is that we ended now. Uh, So where are we? Well, I'm glad you asked. She's one. Focus here. Fan. She's one. 36 a.m. What's the situation? Well, I took the last bus from my old place. We are now in the new place. We have gotten Everything as far as frozen goods. Back in through the fridge, which I still gotta make some adjustments to, but oh well. We have stuff in here. So I can heat up some bread rolls to have cheese or whatever on to eat something. Anywho, that's all together and handy dandy and whatever else. I brought my coke and my chargers and shit. Then inside of here, we have. First of all, a pillow. And then eat you across the place. We have a pillow. This is stuck as per. We have a pillow. And then also up in here. We don't only have a pillow. Whatever the hell it's decided to take the road. Ah, that's right, it's not in there. It's inside of the pillowcase. We also have... We also have my laptop. I'm just gonna rig up in the corner here for the time being. Just so I can put on whatever on my headset. Then, without the proper tools, I'm gonna try and assemble my bed. And whatever the fuck. If I'm lucky, I may find some tools somewhere. In whatever bag that can maybe help me. But got the oven in, so that's now in. Got the fridge in, we still need some adjustment. Then we got the washing machine, the dishwasher in here. 
which means I guess I can kind of get in between there or clothes spin or whatever or I can just put them on top of the dishwasher so basically my idea here is just put a T there bound this bound that take a T bound these two to a T and then just another pipe right down in here although I mean we could probably fit both but yeah I'll figure it out. RGB strip will go along here or whatever the fuck. Server rack will go here. Here. It's a. Uh, it's good shit. I don't know who the fuck around the whatever else somewhere below are. So now I'm gonna unpack that. I'm gonna try and get my bed mounted. And then we'll see where we go from there. So, status update. We got our temporary resolution. And I'm kind of getting the bed together to a degree. We're gonna have to take it apart again because you need to put the feet on and the feet under it on. And I gotta come here with a more proper shrunk to remount this whole shit. But it'll work for tonight. So I can just sleep here because there's no way for me to get back to the other place right now. Oh. We are back and we have a bed. Which is technically normal time for me to be awake, but my feet are dead. I may sit in bed and play something or watch something or whatever. Oh. Holy fucking shit talk. So we are back and oh, holy shit the clock is now 2.58 so basically 3 a.m. We got a Raimi Altsuki on the computer, so we are back, and I took and fried up like two bread, those two bread rolls, ate them together with just some whatever like random as grated cheese I had inside of the fridge. So I've eaten a bit now, so basically, I will chill here for like half an hour maybe. Swap over to ASMR and then fucking sleep because holy shit, my feet are dead. I got fucking blemishes everywhere. My feet are dying, or well, they're already dead. I have the white, but we are back with a phone that has died overnight. This is probably going to make a ruckus and a half and it becomes alive now. So I'm going to put down a vibrator let it rip. So, we are back and we are all well due to my phone dying, it's now 2.33pm. But it's only 2.33pm so it's not like it's way too late. My head is having the greatest time on planet over. Now I gotta figure out a way. Over to my new place. So good shit. So we are back. We had uh, I'm about to hit the road with the boy or whatever. Get my ass to a store, buy some parasat and then probably head back here 
Så titta på de senaste, den här allt igen på buss. Kan man ha sökt det till att du kan ha label för min mailbox, din sova med eller snabb in direkt här. Här var vi du i Gasparas debut i skolan, jag är glad ju att skriva vad allt du är grejt. Uh, alls har det spiss i rest of the weekend, vi got way less boob than what I was hoping for last night, although I guess we got the heaviest. Uh, and uh, I've asked, yeah, he's going to be busy the weekend, although we will need to move everything by bus. I have talked with uh, the old place I was living at, those people, even though they moved to a new place now, they also do not have anything available. I do have one friend I know for a fact lives there, down here that I could ask that maybe has a car, if not at least has a license. <coughs> so we could use my car. But, uh, yeah. So basically what they said up is, is that I have now bought a 24 hour pass. To move shit on the bus now, the problem is, is that I can see it's now raining. No. Oh. Fair of fuck are we? Well, I made it to the other apartment. It was a fun trip and a half with about 200 kilos on a pair of two bar tires and some piece of steel yeah the amount of bursters I'm gonna have after we're done with this it's gonna be something I eat but oh god my ass is wet because I fell on my back with the trolley so we are back and I have well gotten most of our glassware and plates and whatever the fuck sort in here to a semad degree. So I gotta straighten that out, but yeah, I got my bakeware and stuff all in here. One singular pot, so my idea now is to bring that down to Another address label. Oh, 
and um, load all stuff with whatever them figure out what else I want to bring over here tonight. Now I do have that boy which actually can make coffee. I just need to, you know, swap this out of here. And then get this out. And then get this out. Then put Hello. Put uh, that then. I just do this. I do that. And there we go, we have coffee in the morning. So I have coffee now. Oh, I can bring the older boy that has coffee in him. So, <laughs> coffee maker. So in that way that thing is handy that can be used as either a coffee maker or a coffee machine. But I still want to get the new like Sensei or Touch whatever for all this stuff. And then you put my other Maltea one in the back across here or on this side or, or I'll put it here, I don't know. We'll figure something out since this kitchen is smaller than my other kitchen. Could have like made it a little wider, but oh well. So, where are we? Well, I'm glad you asked. We are back in the old apartment. There is my GPUs and my capture card. There is my main workstation. There is my previous computer and all my screens. So, basically what my idea right now is at least to get the stuff that's in this bag and my access point over there. Because then I at least have temporary wireless broadband network or whatever until the coax equipment shows up. Yes, it's coax, it's not fiber, so how how our upload speed is gonna be, I I honestly do not know, especially not as it's collective. I don't even know what my download speeds are gonna be, so you know. I may have to talk to talk to them and see if I can get an upgrade there or whatever, but anywho, we're stuck with coax. Which means we're gonna have to make a coax, buy some coax and run a coax line over to the rack if we decide to run the converter there, unless I just run the converter from there and just run a regular cat cat six line from there, just a regular non non STP whatever. So we are back. And where are we? Well. I got kitchen stuff and food and whatever else up in here. I got more spices and food and whatever else, the fucking access point and whatever else there. Microwave which gets put on top of all of this and then covered. Then I got these three I got to strap onto there somehow. And then I got that bag of stuff. So she is now... 58. So in two minutes I'm gonna take and start lifting this shit down the stairs. And hit again the 00710 bus, uh, 17 bus, the same bus I took last night. With all the shock load of shit. Oh well, we are back. Here is wet. I don't know.
she did get a little bit. Bring that out later. Come on. These are very picky. My God. You're full. That's you know, good shit. Oh well, I guess, maybe, if we're standing evenly on them, this may work. If we stand on the corners, Yes, this is drywall. Yes. Drywall or some kind of wall of something. Which means if we can install shit. 
Så som stjärna för gudde gri. Så den. Det är ju som lätt. Ja, hoj. Okej, kanske inte. Nu går det här ljuset där. Någon av mig har lång, lång knives som jag har fått in här. Så jag har haft svårt av mina knives. Vilket var som värsta gången jag gick. Så, det är själv. Suppose att du smakar med keysbox här. Den har jag nog. Så den är question begåns. How easy it's gonna be to hang that in the roof här. And run over there. Once that happens. For now it's just gonna be laying there for... Okay. Okay, cool shit. So they're not all boots and whatever. The rest of this is just all the screen hardware or whatever. Problem. The problem being... Um, power cables, maybe? Uh, there is a thing. My setup rig box is gonna have some Ethernet cables and at least two. And at least, you know, two IC cables. So. There is one IC cable. Here is a second IC cable. Here is some network wires. There is my switch.
<laughs> well, I wonder why. Waiting for the road there. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> So, we are back and I just got a phone call from the guy delivering, he managed to drive past my place. So... Okay. YouTube. Uh, father should drive past my place. Anywho, I have gotten two blinds up. So now I just got to cut that blind on the To make it fit from here to there. And then above all of this, we'll mount out a curtain rod and then slap some curtains up and that will all be handy and dandy. Granted, I'll we'll have to paint around that, but... Ow, oh, well. It's not the end of the world. If anything, I'll just mount the outer frame grey, I don't know, we'll see. Anywho, we got two blinds up. And then I just need to cut that to size and get brackets. We got the network up and running. He's on the way. We are back. And holy shit, we have food. So we are back and I finished up eating my pizza as much as I decided to eat. We have the bed fully tightened up on feet. Uh, I don't know what the fuck happened on this side, but I'm gonna try and scrub that and clean that. We have got the blanket cover on the blanket again, because it's that time of year where I can start to put that on again. The oven is cranked down quite low, it's pretty much stone cold. Really. Uh, so yeah, we got the wireless broadband antenna hung up in there, and the network is just chugging on. Go through the damn what I'm thinking is trying to find one last screw, and then hang at least this yellow one over here, latch in this, and then try and block up this last, like, whatever. I grant that I do have a screw. Now that I think about it. I do have a screw here. So I may figure something else. The rest of the food is here. So yeah, but really with that. I think I'm gonna take and say thank you guys for watching. Oh hope you guys have enjoyed this move out vlog video or whatever. I don't even know which part for all the right now. Oh, we are starting to get shit moved into the new place. Yeah, but we still got a long way to go. Oh, and then the 20th, it's painting this place and whatever else, and electrical upgrades and. <sighs> but first of all, when we got everything moved from the other place. I don't want to do shit for a week. He fucked a what? It's good shit. Kitterick. Check her out. It's good shit. But what I was saying before the last thing I heard was he fucked an octopus. 
Was det här? Vi har ju gärna låg. Ah, vi stiger en lot to move over. I don't know what I'm gonna move today. Since it's now a new day. I don't even know. To be completely honest with you, I just hope we have an ID for Monday. To get the last stuff moved over because I need at least a day to fill shit and kind of finish up shit or whatever. Clean or write that note or whatever that I'm gonna deliver together with the keys and then. Yeah. Well, you, I will say thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, like it, we greatly appreciate it. And as always, check the links down below for my socials and all of that. And until further notice, stay tuned and see us in the next vlog. The heck out of here.